Hey guys, it's James, and in this video, I'm gonna talk all about using an anticipatory guide in your classroom. So an anticipatory guide is a great way to activate prior knowledge for students. Um, the way this works is, as you see here, this is an example, um, but I believe there are many different ways that you can do it. But the overall gist is that you give students this before um, they read a selected text that you've picked out. And there are several statements. So in this one, there are six examples, some of them true, some of them false. And they just go through where it says your opinion and they either check whether they agree with the statement or they disagree. Once they are finished, you give them a reading, they read through it, then they go back and based on what they read, they will either tell me whether the reading agreed with their original opinion or it disagreed with their original opinion. If it agreed, then they don't have to do anything. However, if the reading disagreed with their opinion, then they need to come to this little section right here, this little column, and they need to provide evidence in their own words to explain why the reading disagreed with them. Now, in the past when I've done this before, students, they would try to get out of this part by going back and trying to erase. So what I have them do now is I have them either use like a pen or a marker or a color pencil and they have to color in or shade it in. If, for example, they decide before they read something that they want to change it, they need to call me over and I will initial off. So that way they can't go back and try to erase it. Um, initially, that's what they would try to do when I first started doing anticipatory, anticipatory guides is that they wanted to get out of the work trying to find the evidence and they would try to go back and erase this. It's something very quick and easy. Again, it's just a quick way for you to pre-assess your students to see what they know about a topic and then you can use that information to um, drive your instruction. So that is an anticipatory guide I hope you liked. If there's anything about this video that you liked or resonated with you, as always, make sure to like, comment, or share the video. Um, and if you haven't already subscribed, make sure to do that so that way you can bond with James. As always, thanks for watching.